So the secret is to use what we call ACT extensions. So you go to View ACT extensions. ACT stands for Ansys Customization Toolkit. And after a few seconds, you see here on the right hand side the ACT. You can click on Launch Wizards, and there's one called HFSS Antenna Toolkit. You click on here, and then you have a huge selection of antennas that you can select. You can choose like a PIFA, um, you know, like a patch antenna dipole. And what you can do, you can uh, select the frequency that you want. Like this is a, a dipole, right? You can select like something like eight gigahertz. You click synthesis, and we automatically compute the length, the width, the feed gap uh, based on analytical equations. This one uh, comes from the famous Bellani's book. And you can just click Finish, and automatically we will create an HFSS project already set up for you with all the dimensions. So here we have our project of our uh, dipole. If, if you click here, you can see that we have all the variables. So for example, the dipole length. Uh, 1.37, if you change this to 1, you see that uh, it will automatically update uh, the geometry. You can run what we call parametric uh, analysis. You right-click in Optometrics, Add Parametric, and you can change, for example, you can add that uh, dipole length. You can simulate from 0 0.5 to 1.5 with a 0 0.5 step. You click on Add, OK, and here on table it will show the variations that we're going to solve. You can go to options and make sure you, you hit self, save fields and mesh. So you save not only the S parameters, but also uh, you know fields and radiation patterns. And that's it.